वेलकम बैक टू इनफिज्ञान माई डियर फ्रेंड्स टूडे इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू टेक अप वन वेरी इंटरेस्टिंग एंड चैलेंजिंग नेस्टेड रेडिकल इक्वेशन प्रॉब्लम इट इज स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ वन प्लस एक्स टाइम्स स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ वन प्लस एक्स प्लस वन टाइम्स स्क्वायर रूट ऑफ वन प्लस एक्स प्लस टू एंड सो ऑन इक्वल टू थ्री एक्स इज गिवन टू अस नॉन नेगेटिव इट इज पॉजिटिव एग्जैक्टली सो वी विल सॉल्व दिस क्वेश्चन यूजिंग रामानुजम्स अप्रोच सो लेट्स गेट स्टार्टेड what was his approach let us write x plus 1 in general so we can consider it is x plus 1 whole square any time we can write square root of square now i will expand a plus b whole square so i can write a square plus b square plus 2ab i will take x common from these two and i will write 1 as it is at the beginning 1 plus x x plus 2 so this is one result actually once i will be solving x plus 2 see how it will work x plus 2 suppose i want to write what i will write square root 1 plus c x is one number shorter than or one number is smaller than x plus 1 so i will write here x plus 1 and x plus 2 is one number bigger than x plus 1 so i will write here one number is smaller than x plus 2 is x plus 1 and one number bigger than x plus 2 is x plus 3 so result i will use these result once i will be solving my lhs x plus 3 how i can write 1 plus one number is smaller so x plus 2 one number bigger x plus 4 x plus 4 that value i will consider 1 plus x plus 3 and x plus 5 let's consider lhs of our equation i will begin with the same result x plus 1 equal to the square root of i will write 1 plus x times x plus 2 now consider x plus 2 separately so i will write now 1 plus x and x plus 2 i will write my formula again 1 plus one number is smaller so x plus 1 one number bigger so x plus 3 again same job i will consider with x plus 3 so it will become 1 plus x square root of 1 plus x plus 1 is square root of let us write directly x plus 3 how i will write 1 plus one number is smaller so x plus 2 and one number bigger than x plus 3 so x plus 4 rest would be as it is now i will write the very last time x plus 4 so this will come out 1 plus x square root of 1 plus x plus 1 is square root of 1 plus x plus 2 now the turn off writing x plus 4 is straight away i will write in the recursive form 1 plus x plus 3 1 one number is smaller than x plus 4 is x plus 3 x plus 5 will be 1 greater and if i will continue doing the same thing in this order then i will be having my lhs this will be your lhs if you will see if you will proceed from here also x plus 5 you will write is square root of 1 plus x plus 4 times x plus 6 you will continue you will be getting your lhs so in this place in lhs place i will write it is x plus 1 and right hand side is 3 so i will write x plus 1 equal to 3 take away 1 from both sides x plus 1 minus 1 3 minus 1 1 1 one will be over x will be equal to 2 our answer is x equal to 2 let us consider one more case see here you won't get any x value you have to simplify how you will begin here so we will consider one number it is 
3 can be written as a square root of 9. Any time we can write. Now 9 is a square root of 1 plus 8. So 1 is done now. Now only try to match with this order. Okay. 8 can we write 2 times 4? So yes. 2 times 4. Now 2 is also done. Now 4 can we write a square root 16 because a square root is needed. 1 plus 2 times a square root of 16. Now a square root of 16 is there. So we can write 1 plus 2 times 16 can we write in terms of 1 plus 15. Now up to this point it is okay. Now let us consider 15 as 3 times 5. So I will write 1 plus 2 times the square root of 1 plus 3 times 5. Now 3 is also done. In the same sequence, I will write 5 as a square root of 25. So we can write 1 plus 3 times a square root of 25. So this time we will write 25 as 1 plus 24. So let me write here equal to square root of 1 plus 2 times square root of 1 plus 3 times of square root of 1 plus 24. Now in the same way I will write 24 as 4 times 6. So square root of 1 plus 2 square root of 1 plus 3 times square root of 1 plus 4 times 6. So now you can see it is almost matching up to this extent. Now in next proceeding you will write 6 as square root 36. So your left hand side if you will keep doing like this you will get your LHS up to infinity that means nested radical equation or expression. So left hand side we will have this form. So what I will write in that place that is actually the value of 3. So this is proposed by one of the math genius Ramanujam. I hope this video will be meaningful to you. Do not forget to like, share and subscribe friends. Bye bye till next video. Good luck and take care of yourself.